What's up everybody, this is your boy Aries from the Fast Freak Studio. Today, I'll be showing you guys some epically won battles in Clash of Clash Royale. So, the first one goes like this. So, this video is all about the first battle is not that very well, but you know, that's a very good one. So let's get started with that. So I've thrown in my giant skeleton from the left hand side, and he has thrown in the, you know, the Inferno to defend the giant skeleton and the hog ladder, which was a very good feed spell. It did a kind of work, and here the dragon's taking out a bit of a tower. But the giant ball, the giant group, just destroys the inferno, but it messes it with the tower. So, now, got my barbarians. Barbarians are moving towards each of the side as I split them up. So I throw in my golden barrel, he throws in his. I only to defend them, and here comes my barbarians. And uh, the barbarian just got two hits from that, so I have sent the min minion horde just to defend the witch and the dragon, as you can see over there. It will be taking out both of them in no time. So he's just kept his entire tower over there, but it will be taken out by my minion horde quite quickly. So. The giant skeleton will be killed by the minion horde quite quick, quickly, but the giant one does affect the, the little bit of the tower. By a little bit, I mean a lot. So, after that, uh, my goblin will take off those two minions. Okay? And here comes the hog ladder and the, uh, you know, the goblins. Okay, the hog ladder just takes out the tower. As you can see over there, there is no thing to worry about. I saw one of my arrows over there, which will take all of the skeletons. But I had to defend the dragon from the right hand of the paint, and the hog rider is well defended. It was a very bad idea for him to throw in both of them. So I throw in my goblin barrel, he just throws in his minion board. But the minion board will be killed by my arrows, and here comes the this is a really good part of the point. Here comes the skeleton all the way from the left side of the right side of the plane to the dragon's hook so he is really part of the minion for the nice to get them. So the half rider is taking two hits, no only one. What the hell was that? What the hell was that? Okay. So the he drops in his inferno, but he freezes them all. So I just throw in my skeleton and then arrows and look at that. Four hit points left when the hog rider is just taking out the tower. Okay, this was the first one. So let's head on to the next one. Okay, so the next one is completely epic. As you can see it's three on two of wonders. Okay, so we'll be loading in As you can see, his name is Drodri something tree, okay? So I've got a complete new deck over there. Here comes the minion horde and the goblin the goblins, okay? So I didn't have anything to you know defend those so you know the my tower is taking fuck it. Very good. He might have been obsessed of this and had tried not to defend my tower when Valkyrie is hitting that giant skeleton and the hog rider is pulling it away. He doesn't have anything to you know, defend that, so he throws in the goblin barrel. I just drop in my goblin for the left hand and goblin spear goblins for the right hand. Goblins to defend the 
giant skeleton from the hallway. And here goes a Prince, okay? Prince will be taken out by my minion board. He always takes one charge on the place, okay? So he drops in his minion board, which will not be defended by me. So I just throw in the fireball just to make sure that I don't lose the okay? There was a really bad time so I dropped in my bomb tower just beside that poison spell just to avoid bomb tower to be killed quite quickly. So the poison spell takes up a lot of damage to my tower. So my tower is about 600, okay? So the next same type of mistake is done twice, okay? But this time I'm not making a mistake. As I throw in my goblin and the spear goblins to defend that thing, but the red taken out by the giant bomb. I do not do anything to defend the goblin barrel. It's only 200 over there and 1800. Okay, so he sent in his minion horde. I just arrowed him quite late, so there are two more left. So about only 51 seconds over there in the clock. So he throws in the rocket just. You know, he's not sure that I'll be taking out his tower, but I am, I am, thank you man. So here comes all of my troops, he throws in a free spell over there just to defend all a little bit of that. But, you know, that was a very bad idea, you know? but, I mean, he doesn't send in a free spell, but I just thought that was it. You know, my arrow is again messed up. He threw in the rocket to you know, take out the bomb tower, and the main port still coming in. The prince is going to take charge over there, but he ain't. So, here comes my hog rider and the half for you from the behind, but I'm not doing anything to defend that giant skeleton over there. So, he will take out my minions. And here again, I've got the main he drops in the goblin barrel, I don't have anything to do with that. He drops in his minion horde, but as soon as he does that, I get the full power tower win. So that's all guys. You know, there was a very epic one, I just wanted to do a very hard time just come back to a lot of that. I got two arrows, thank you for that. Okay, so this was it for today.